Hello, guys. What's going on? Got two here. Could have significant hidden injuries when you have a motor vehicle collision. We started our patient care, when all of a sudden a male stepped in the side door of the ambulance and identified himself as her son. You got everything you Yeah, yep. You and he's going to be going to women. All right, hey, let's look. Try not to get our blood pressure up, okay? You don't tell me nothing about my mother mama, man. Get out, get out there. I don't have to go no mother Get out. I don't have to go nowhere. Who Need PD, need PD. All of a sudden, this guy, the patient's son, just lost it. Step out the way. Fire, need your help. Get out of the truck. Get out of the truck. Get out of the truck. Get off of me. Get off the street. Someone hit their emergency button. Get out of here. Immediate response is fear. Are my coworkers okay? Is my family okay? Because if somebody hits that button, all hell is breaking loose. Messing, I want that man booked for assault on the EMT. Man, he put his hand on me first. My mom and everybody. Away. I asked you to step out of the unit. You failed to do so. You man, failed to do so. We get back in the truck, and I was feeling a lot of pain in my shoulder. And my left hand was numb at the time. We need to make sure that our family member is okay. Tried to talk to him, find out what was going on, and uh, tried to calm him down. And but that definitely didn't work. And as soon as we kind of started stepping towards the side of the road, he took a swing and hit me. IMSA supervisor Jason Duncan took a direct hit. I can definitely feel it. What are you guys taught to do when someone starts coming at you? Uh, Defend yourself. Once you're being attacked, you're, you're taught to defend yourself, keep yourself safe. Uh, while they were rendering aid, um, they got in an altercation and um, both um, firefighters were stabbed. The area was crowded with witnesses. He says his head was down while he typed the report, he glanced up and saw the woman holding a gun. The gun was right here, so I mean, not even, you know, two or three feet away. She didn't see me coming and, you know, I saw the gun, so I immediately just leapt. Uh, she got one shot off. Haywood says they struggled on the floor of the ambulance and she fired a second shot that hit here. I mean, I was in fear of my life throughout this whole struggle and she was trying to kill me.